On the 13th of March 2021, 56-year-old Philip Hollis was taking the usual Merseyvale service from Liverpool Central to Kirby. He was driving 507006 at the front and 507021 at the back. It was a normal day, normal service. However, Philip may not have expected it all to end in a prison sentence. It is around quarter to seven on a cold March evening and the passenger numbers are low. The service was running smoothly, yet despite this, Philip had a distraction, his phone. After departing for Zachary, Philip was still messaging and combined with his bag falling down, he was very distracted. Despite this, Philip cancelled the automatic warning system, meaning he must have known he was an approach to Kirby Station, a terminus, where Merseyrail and Northern Mail meet, separated by buffer stops and a large concrete divide from the bridge. As Philip looked up, he saw the horror and slammed on the emergency brakes, but it was too late. At 6.53pm, 507006 collided with the buffers at approximately 29 miles an hour, derailing the unit and sending it crashing through the concrete divide before quickly arriving to a stop. Travelling around 28 metres beyond the buffer stop, Philip was taken to hospital as precaution, but no other injuries were found. The guard and 12 passengers were also only mildly injured. Philip initially denied anything, claiming he was just distracted by his bag falling on the floor, and while that was true, it wasn't the full story. When police searched his phone, they found that he sent a WhatsApp message just 26 seconds before the train collided with the buffers. Philip had already been released from Merseywell and was sentenced to 12 months in prison for causing £450,000 in damage and endangering passengers, adding that if it was not during COVID restrictions, there would have been many more passengers, including on the platform, which could have caused catastrophic results. 507021 was not damaged at all and was able to be dragged away and is still in service as of making this video. However, 507006 was significantly damaged and taken out of service before inevitably being written off and scrapped due to the new Merseywell Class 777 trains being too soon. The driving cab of 507006 was incredibly damaged and not worth repairing or retesting. Now, let's ask, how does a train just enter a station at 41 miles an hour when the limit is 15? Well, a lot of reasons. First off, had acknowledged the danger signal. Whether he actually had or not is a different story, but he did press the cancel button. There was also TPWS, which should, in theory, have tripped the overspeed sensors and put on the emergency brakes. However, the train had not met the requirements to apply the brakes automatically. In addition, it's possible that he would have already applied the emergency brakes. Now let's ask, how do we prevent this? Well, to begin, do not use a phone while driving, whether that's a car, plane, train, bus, anything. And my other recommendation is to lower the speed limit on the TPWS um, speed sensor. If it was at a lower speed, it's most likely that a collision would not have happened. And possibly if they do lower it, an incident like this could never happen again. Because, in fact, this incident at this exact station has occurred many times before. Let's hope that this never happens again. Thank you.